สบายดีเชียวราคุณอาทิตย์นู้นทุกคนนี่วิดีโอเป็นเหตุให้เด็กๆและเด็กๆที่คุณไม่รู้ภาษาอังกฤษ Lao. We would like you to have a benefit and briefly understand about Lao classical music instrument of ancient Lao or. Uh, kingdom of Lao Lan Sang to know a little bit about our ancient Lao playing instrument called Ken or Ken Lao in New Zealand. It has been observed that in Laos we Have l o u d can in so many p r o v i n c e s of l o u d For example, in Vientiane, s i m u n g Buddhist Temple, and at the s a v a n n a k e t Province at the main street, or k a i s o n p o m b e h a n City. Also, we have can two places in one province called uh, Can Garden in the middle of Sarawan Province and uh, uh, Thampa Garden or Cave. Also, we have a couple of can at Maha Nati s i t a n d o n Or s e t a n d o n Province of c h a m p a s a k at the south of Lao, we have the can for souvenir of our country as well. Uh, also in Thailand, uh, the Thai Isan people who used to be a Lao citizen uh, in the past, they have also. A can at b a k s o n g City of n a k h o n l a s a s i m a or k o r a Province of Thailand. I observe that there is no Lao uh, uh, instrument classical music of Lao. Or can uh, construction in any other country, even large or small country in the world, for example in USA, Canada, England, France, and Australia, even Japan, where we have the Lao ethnic city living in. Because of the war for in Lao, at present, it has been observed that there is no Lao construction in any abroad country, for the exception of uh, New Zealand. New Zealand, a small country, but we have a Lao musical ancient instrument to show our culture. Like a Lao proverb said, "Where is a Lao, there is a can. Where is a s t r i k i l a i there is a Lao. Where is a, a p i c k l e fish, there is a Lao living around the world." Uh, three kind of thing are symbol of Lao. Particular can musical instrument is a spiritual of all love, 
in anywhere around the world. That is why I, Mahatongyan Kekotong, that's my name, and uh, my wife, Tongsian Kekotong, that's her name, we both decided to build up the can at Lao Buddhist Temple in Otoho in New Zealand for preserve our uh, national uh, musical instrument can to show the foreigner and to our own children the Lao children who uh, was born in foreign country like in New Zealand and some other country around the world to know about your mother tongue uh, musical instrument can like uh, the Lao people know this can this musical instrument very well uh, like they know themselves you probably may not visit Lao, you probably may not know at all about Lao musical instrument called Lao if you never visit Laos. This is for foreigner. For the Lao children, if your parent did not tell you, if you did not visit that Lao, you probably will not know anything about your mother tongue musical instrument Laos. That's the main issue. We, my wife and I, decided to uh, construct the can in at Lao Temple in. Auckland city of New Zealand for a souvenir of Lao children and for respect our national musical instrument of Lao in the future uh, to remain this we ask the permission to build this musical instrument from the Lao Temple Association. Uh, at the meeting on that year, that's in 2017, some of them do not like the idea of uh, building can at Lao Temple. The reason is uh, instrument playing musical instrument and uh, Buddhist temple is a different issue. Yeah, therefore, the idea of not to have the can at the temple is about the Buddhist religion. Uh, second issue was uh, raised at the committee in 2017. Yeah about uh, the can uh, should be built outside the temple for example like uh, along the beach any other uh, public area to separate can from the temple this is the second group ideas. The answer for that is we do not have a public area to build up our can. Uh, this is not our country, it's not Laos, it's in New Zealand. It may against the public of New Zealand. Uh, we can only build this can in our own land our own section like our embassy in another country temple is uh, situated of 
Buddhist uh, in New Zealand and Auckland, our own land, our own property. Therefore, it was explained well at the meeting dossier. Therefore, the second group finally agreed with us to be of the can. Where to be of the can and how big, how long the can, we have a prepare and report to the meeting. And we have built the can exactly like what we uh, agree at the meeting. For example, the can is made of piece of uh, 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 iron tooth. The length is seven meters. We bury under the ground for one meter. Uh, at the state, small state above the ground uh, is uh, 30 centimeter. And the top from the ground to the top of the can or the height of the can from the ground is uh, six meter. Under the ground is one meter. This is a permanent uh, construction of can as a permanent uh, prop or the permanent issue in Lao a property at the Lao temple itself. This can is a plan to build by the builder like myself and my wife since uh, 2017, the end of the years. On that time, the Lao government submit the application for Lao to be the world heritage of Lao to United Nations or UNESCO organization in New York. They uh, nominate the committee member to travel to Laos to observe and investigate the background, the Urkinon of Laos with the Lao official Lao people even in the city or in the village to know more and detail of uh, Lao Khen ancient musical instrument. They also observe Khen also is played by the northern part of uh, Cambodia and no western part called Isan of Thailand as the same as Lao. But however, from the uh, observation and discovery, this organization found that the real original of Khen musical instrument was originally made in Laos or uh, Lao Lansang or Kingdom of Lao uh, at that time. Khen was built originally in Lao first since the ancient time. There is no evidence mentioned exactly what year or uh, what a king of Luyan of Lao who decided to help uh, Lao as a national playing con instrument of Lao know exactly history about this. Just only 
the Lao people or foreigner have heard that Khen was built in Lao since ancient time, thousand thousand years ago, built up by the Lao forest hunter. Uh, the brief history is there was one uh, forest uh, hunter who came to the forest and wait uh, quietly inside the forest. That place, there are a lot of uh, a small bamboo and big or small kind of tree where the animal come to have a food or drink the water nearby. The forest animal hunter many nights he had to sleep inside the jungle or forest uh, to observe and hunt the animal. Why he was in the jungle, he normally hear the beautiful uh, voice or the noise of the bird. The bird sing the song from the uh, top of the bamboo tree very nicely. He listened very carefully and he felt he liked that kind of uh, noise. He came back to the village and told on the villager that he observed the bird singing nicely song. And he came back to the forest again many times and he slept in the jungle many, many times as well. And he listened to the birds singing on the top of the bamboo tree several times or sometimes from another uh, top of big tree at the deep forest. He raised the voice of the bird song day by day badly. And finally, he tried to make a rope of things to make the similarly noise of such bird. For example, he picked up the leaf of tree, grow inside, it made the noise as well, but not as beautiful as a great noise of the bird. He cut the uh, bamboo, made the horn, and blow inside the horn. It made the noise as well, but not as nigh as the noise or the voice of the bird. He used the piece of a uh, tree, dry or a uh, green, put it together, it made the noise, but not as noise, as not as beautiful noise as the noise of the bird. The bird. He picked up a uh, piece of stone in the forest and put it t together slowly or hardly. It made the noise as well, but as the same, not make as beautiful noise as the voice of the bird. He was thinking many, many times, day by day, month by month and year by year pass, he uh, changed his method of making can many times from many items. And finally, he cut the small bamboo tree and when it was green, he made the noise not beautiful. He dry is up to is completely dry 
he made the horn on small bamboo tree and he heard the noise coming out but not as nice as the noise of the bird. Uh, he tried to put uh, something inside the small horn made by the, another piece of uh, bamboo, not very nice noise, and he changed to the silver or copper, very, very thin, put inside. He made a different noise and quite nice noise but not exactly like the noise of the bird. Uh, he successful made it. He play in a village. Many villagers at his village observe that and learn that from him. At the farm, he was a farmer. And at the forest, he was an animal hunter. He play such can he made up by him many times. He enjoy listen to the noise of that can badly. Many uh, vineyard ledger even within his own village or nearby village uh, came to observe. He play the can instrument, and they also like. Uh, the noise of his can very much and the news come to the city the king of the city or country at that time uh, heard the uh, people said he uh, wanted uh, to see to listen and to know the can more yeah, he then, and the officer came to the village and invited uh, such uh, foreign animal hunter to come to his palace with such musical instrument. And the king asked him to play the can. He play as he play at his village or the farm or the forest. The king liked the noise of the can very much. The can, uh, the king enjoyed can very much. Therefore, he ordered him to train another, another officer to make the can and play the can. So he had done that. The can since that time was a very popular no on around the country, many city of Kingdom of Lao on that time uh, started playing and making uh, the noise for enjoyable places in music since then. Uh, there was no name at that time. Yeah, he uh, tried to call the can himself that's a, a small bamboo tree small bamboo tree as original the can made by small uh, a bamboo tree a still long finally the king uh, given the name as a can short remember easily by the public therefore since then can and uh, was called can as we call today since then talking about can it uh, became to know whole part of the country the people play can with a different uh, a method. We call in Lao like the wind blowing 
tree leaf or we call uh, fin bro the banana uh, leaf tree at the early morning before uh, clear up still dark another issue or method they call uh, the female dog running uh, on the beach uh, this is the uh, meaning uh, of or pattern of the can playing uh, uh, by the player whole part of Lao from north to south for every kind of festival to make the people happy uh, to uh, at the temple or outside the temple like at the village at the village wedding or another kind of phase or festival the people like the can day by day month by month and year by year many years later therefore can is accepted as spiritual of the Lao people anywhere in the country or outside the country the Lao people like can very much as that the official of Lao meaning the Lao government uh, submit the application to United Nations UNESCO organization uh, to recognize Lao musical instrument as well as can before accepted can to be the world heritage of Lao the member of UNESCO organization officer came to Lao to study the original of can or the background of can how the can uh, was made who made the can who write the can any can was made in another country apart from Laos they understood that northern part of uh, Kampuchea at the Lao border before uh, in such a place belong to Laos they used to play can as well but not whole part of the country as Lao only some uh, former Lao citizen of uh, Kampuchean prison or ethnic city or national or ethnic con uh, city also can was a play or accepted whole part of northern part of Thai called Thai Isan. Thai Isan as well before a French regime in Lao or before Lao became colony to France government. Uh, that part of the world uh, was invaded by Thai a king that part of the world belonged to Thai and became Thai uh, since then therefore the uh, musical instrument is as the same as Lao play horn part of Isan every provinces play the can like Lao but they there was not original of can in thailand uh, can was made originally in lao unesco officer has learned observed and known all of this therefore finally the committee of unesco decided can uh, is originally belonged to Lao 
on another world they have registered for law official that can is the world heritage of Lao people democratic republics only not belong to any other country apart from that in south america continent there is a musical instrument similarly to can made by bamboo as well but short very short not as long as lao can lao can uh, the length is a start from uh, one meter two meter uh, three meter depend on uh, 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 how big uh, of can the can builder decide to make it we have a start from uh, can tree can tree is a very small can with uh, three couple of bamboo shoot small bamboo shoot the next we call can seven again there are seven uh, couple of uh, small bamboo shoot we can uh, we call can eight again there are eight a couple of small musical instrument the large can we call can night can night consisted with the nine couple of small bamboo shoot together yeah and they make uh, the small horn a square horn and uh, put the uh, little piece of uh, silver or couple inside and the can uh, controlled by the uh, main wood of can blower uh, we call, call in Lao Tao can the player uh, play by putting the wind from his mouth inside the can and make the nice nice noise and his hand moving from one couple of the can horn to another horn make it a different sound different noise depend on what kind of song the player reaches to make um, i went to laos from new zealand I am living in New Zealand since 1984. Uh, we was invited to the uh, literature horn. Uh, there, uh, there is a can as well of uh, ex Prime Minister of Lao Khan Kai Son Pomehan. Kai Son Pomehan the eighth prime minister or first prime minister of Lao of uh, socialist regime he liked the can very much himself uh, on those times when he was young he announced the Lao radio news from hanoi the capital of north vietnam on that time uh, before he started his uh, Lao uh, program from uh, Vietnam or Hanoi uh, he uh, start from the uh, opening the uh, the noise of the can first then he uh, start the noise uh, if any of you had a chance to visit Lao to visit Vientiane to visit the literature horn you will see the big photograph of uh, such uh, prime minister kai son pomehan play the can uh, and, and in the inside inside 
this literature horn not outside i have seen myself you are welcome to watch some time when you have time uh, to visit uh, laos or vientian anyway even the ex lao who uh, brought to uh, middle part of uh, thailand since uh, Anuvong king or feudal of last king of Vietnam called uh, Anuvong king. Uh, he was arrested by uh, King Chao Noi of Siang Khuang province and hand over him to the Thai authority. They took him uh, to Bangkok the capital of Thai at the uh, uh, second uh, period of Thailand king. And finally, king of Lao, Anuvong, was passed away in Bangkok, or Thailand, after war. Uh, this kind of people I describe about that's uh, ex Lao people in the middle part of Thailand, many provinces such as uh, Supan uh, province, Saraburi province, Ang Thong province, Nakhon Patom province, Lach Buri province, and many, many provinces of the middle part of Thailand, the Thai uh, official brought Lao people from Vientiane uh, to stay permanently, not allowed to go back home Vientiane since then. And they live in middle part of Thailand in many, many provinces of Thailand at the middle part since then and cannot return Lao. They brought along with them the Laotian ancient art, uh, method of uh, cooking, method of making national clothes, and method of uh, Lao Nisukon instrument called can. They play can on among Lao uh, people from Vientiane. Majority the Lao people in the middle part of Thailand uh, were from Vientiane, the capital of Lao on that time. And the Thai government decided to build, uh, to put fire uh, on Vientiane two occasions. Uh, uh, I and my wife visited lately in uh, 2019 to eight Lao people who still uh, had the culture mode of eating, drinking, or playing musical instrument and exactly the Lao people playing now. Of course, they uh, Lao brought to Thailand uh, by Thai authority on those times when we lost the war to Thailand. Uh, at my visit to a uh, group of Lao people at Don Kha village Supan province, they told me on brief detail which they uh, learned or they have been told by their parents, like uh, the musical instrument can, they still play can over there, and they have the folk song for their own called Lao Viang folk song. I asked them to sing the folk song for me for the Lao Viang. Uh, 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 a proper uh, name or 
Lawian uh, given this name by our ancestor in Lao. They and uh, play and they saw they play the can and the sock thing sock singer uh, sing the uh, Lao Sian folk song to me. I learned from them therefore after come back to New Zealand I practice to uh, sing the Lao folk song uh, of the uh, uh, Lao Viang uh, method. Since then I am okay now. I uh, play uh, 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 the uh, folk song many occasions to the Lao and Thai Isan group um, uh, together many uh, festival, many program, many uh, places, particularly in Auckland, New Zealand. The reason I made the uh, uh, video in English version because I would like to uh, I would like uh, to remain the La Lao Laotian can as national uh, musical instrument of Lao to be known to be known uh, by the foreigners at overseas or to be known by the use of Lao uh, ethnic city, the use of Lao in every country around the world to know something little bit about their own national ancient meaning uh, 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 musical instrument of Lao. In the future to remain our Laotian can to be in this one permanently forever. We, the elderly person, for example, like myself, I am now 73 years of age. I was born in 1949 in Vientiane, Laos. I um, expect I will be in this world uh, not many years, maybe 20 years, luckily, but I wish to be up to 100 years, like uh, the uh, president of uh, Lao uh, Buddhist relationship in Lao uh, nominate or started by him called Mahakamtan from Patit Lao. Uh, he had a very good age of 100 years before he passed away, but he, his health was okay, never been sick. He still can walk to the temple on a regular basis. He is well known by government, well known by on Lao people, he came from the southern part of Lao. He spent uh, 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 ten years at the forest at uh, uh, Siang Kuang, a province, uh, with the Patelao soldier. Uh, he came to Vientiane after the Patelao and won the negotiation in Vientiane. Uh, the uh, conference in 1972-73 and the community took over uh, Laos and came to the Vientiane with uh, Mahakamtan and uh, President Supanavong Kaison and uh, a committee member of Patelao in 1975. They occupy all part of Lao and uh, by the uh, uh, Patelao 
on all left side or the community sides of Lao, we Lao finished the monarchy, the king, uh, in that year, uh, 1975. Uh, therefore, I would like to express my sincere thanks to the government of Lao, socialism government of Lao or government of Lao, after they invaded Lao, completely whole part of the country, a lot of people uh, uh, was not recognized their regime. They fled river to be refugee in many places, many refugee camps from north uh, uh, to south at northern part of Thailand called uh, Isan including the one who is with King with you now, was a member of a Lao refugee at Napo, Lao refugee camp with my family, my uh, nephew and father as well. We were at the refugee camp at Napo, Lao refugee camp for four years. I myself escaped from Lao. Uh, to Thailand across the Mekong River since 1981. We waited at the Puch Camp on that time called Puch Camp, not refugee camp. Puch Camp, it means that the United uh, Nations UNHCR High Commission uh, United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, or USHCR, uh, propaganda every day and invite the people, allow people to, to, to leave the uh, detention camp, invite them to go back Lao, saying to us that no refugee program, no resettlement in the third country anymore. The uh, refugee who escaped to Thailand from Lao from 1975 to 1980, they were recognized as refugee by UNHCR or United Nations. They officially allow for resettlement, new resettlement in, in any third country. Therefore, a lot of Lao people from whole part of Lao escaped to Thailand and being recognized by a United Nations. They were sent to uh, the third country for resettlement. For example, the big number in USA, in Canada, France, England, uh, uh, Japan, Australia, New Zealand, and other countries by a small number, including uh, Argentina in South America continent as well. Therefore, the Lao people in everywhere, they recognize the Lao musical ancient instrument called can. They recognize can, make and playing can in every country around the world. Uh, so far, I fully understood. Particularly, I myself used to work for uh, New Zealand government, work for immigration New Zealand services for all together 29 years, uh, 10 months, and 17 days from 21st of March 1985 right up to 5th of uh, April 2014 that's the total period of time I used to work for uh, immigration of New Zealand uh, government at the refugee quota uh, branch during 29 years, I was officially sent to interview a refugee 
and the United Nations High Commissioner or UNHCR uh, uh, information provided and invited us to come and interview and brought them officially uh, for resettlement in New Zealand by the budget from the New Zealand government. Every year, New Zealand government has spent a lot or large amount of budget uh, for refugee program of New Zealand government. New Zealand government paid the airfare for the refugees coming to New Zealand and never request the refugee to pay back to the government. The government given the an air passage ticket money fee for the refugee for completely, absolutely free. Except uh, one uh, one uh, time, the government want to learn uh, USA refugee program. The government uh, issue big lump sum of money to uh, ICCI Interjust Commission on Immigration for Refugee to use such money to buy a ticket for the refugee and. Uh, that organization, ICCI organization, asked the refugee to refund the ticket to the government. <coughs> <coughs> Any amount so far they can pay. Uh, later on, uh, such a program uh, was a stop. The refugee had not enough money to pay. Some of them has paid back. Some of them paid some not in full, some of them uh, never pay at all. It was officially stopped since then up to now. The New Zealand government still accept the refugee from overseas any country around the world from uh, Europe, from uh, Middle East, uh, from uh, 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 Africa and any other small big country around the world. I was sent uh, to interview refugees since uh, 1987. Uh, before that, I was trained how to interview the refugee uh, at the refugee uh, branch since 1987. 85, 86, two years uh, completely I never been selected or sent by government to interview the refugee uh, overseas. Uh, since 1987, I was sent every year, year by year. I had a lot of experience or skill of interview uh, many um, ethnic or nationality of the refugee coming to New Zealand after I have a full knowledge or good experience I was nominated by the government many times uh, to be the leader of team uh, normally we went uh, together uh, two and sometimes three sometimes four officer immigration officer at the same time depend on how big or large number of refugees who we have to to interview. We uh, process the application, resident application for them, issue the resident visa for them and send the escort. Sometimes I watch an uh, escort sent by the government to escort the refugee from overseas and refugee camp or from overseas airport uh, brought them here to New Zealand for uh, resettlement permanently in New Zealand. A lot of them or majority became New Zealand citizen uh, ship after uh, some time. Uh, before, it took only three years before they can become New Zealand citizenship. Uh, later on or even now they have to be in New Zealand for 
uh, two year first before they can apply for permanent resident of New Zealand. Why before the government issue the resident visa for them uh, before brought them in to New Zealand on the foreigner uh, like uh, refugee they must be in New Zealand for completely five years now before they can apply for uh, New Zealand citizenship and using New Zealand passport like any other New Zealand they got the rights and they got the privilege like exactly New Zealand citizen who was New Zealand by citizenship or New Zealand by birth in New Zealand, the land of Maori up to now. I said the video is too long now. I have to uh, stop uh, my uh, brief detail of uh, video of Vulcan uh, now. Kakite uh, Ano, thank you very much. Khop Jai Lai Lai Nơ, Sao Nung Lao, Thì Đại Phang Nguồn Vệ Rồ Nì, Sao Bài Đi.